Tonight, the Supreme Court is preparing for a second day of arguments on President Obama's controversial health care reform law. Opponents say it's unconstitutional and want it repealed. Yeah, almost all Americans will be affected by the high court's decision. Today, the justices took up a threshold question. Can they even decide this case right now? KCAL 9's Jan Crawford has the developments from today's hearing. The public outcry over the shooting death of Florida teen Trayvon Martin is intensifying in Los Angeles. Uh, it, the weather is, well, it's changing. Um, it's nicer. I don't even know where it's going to go. Let's talk to <laughs> Evelyn Taft to see what it's going to be like. Because it was sunny and warm at one point, but really not as warm as we like it, Evelyn. Exactly. GOP presidential hopeful Mitt Romney is in Southern California raising money for his campaign. This afternoon, he attended a private event in Irvine. Lunch was $1,000. Another $1,500 allowed donors to attend a photo reception. Earlier today, he spoke about Obama's health care plan at a medical device company in San Diego. This evening, Romney's in the Bay Area holding for another fundraising event, and then he comes back to Southern California again tomorrow to do the Tonight Show with Jay Leno. Still ahead here at 9 is Southern California military wife spearheads a new internet movement. Sharon, thank you. An Afghan soldier has shot and killed three British troops at a NATO base in southern Afghanistan. Officials say international forces returned fire and killed the soldier. Today's shooting is the latest in a series of attacks in which Afghan security forces have attacked international soldiers. The attacks have become more common since the burning of Qurans at a U.S. base last month. Killings. Bales is charged with more than a dozen counts of murder. He's being held in a military prison at Fort Leavenworth, Kansas. So thank you. Divers have recovered the five bodies that were found last week in the wreck of the Costa Concordia. The recovery. A movie prop caused a big scare in Hollywood this afternoon. There's an Easter egg hunt that happens every year, but tonight we know it's canceled. It's all because parents, not the kids, were getting too aggressive. It caused some parents and kids to not want to come back and for city officials to cancel it altogether. Businesses in and around the area say uh, having the event canceled really breaks their hearts. Yeah, the old Colorado City Association says it will meet to consider whether to bring back that egg hunt next year. And that's going to do it for us here on KCAL 9 News at 9. There's more ahead. KCAL 9 News at 10 starts right now.